Let's head to Flamborough for Allen Cup Hockey. It's game one of the J. Ross Robertson Cup Championship Final. The Wentworth Griffins and the Stony Creek Tigers facing off in a best of three series with the winner claiming the cup and moving on to the Allen Cup Championship. Jumping in the first period and how about this start for the Griffins. Matt McLeod spots out Alex Hutchings out front and Hutchings finishes the opener. That goal coming just five minutes into the first and it's 1-0 Wentworth. A good start for the Griffins and moments later it's more from the Wentworth forward check. Eric Diodotti picks it off on the pinch and he sets up Matt McLeod for a tap in. It's two quick goals from the Griffins and it's 2-0 Wentworth. Later in the frame now the Tigers trailing by a pair and it's Josh Rinaldi stepping up for Stony Creek. He walks into the zone and snipes it. That goal cuts the Griffins lead in half and we would head to the second 2-1 Griffins. Into the second period now and the Tigers would keep coming. Michael Roberto springs Cordell James on the breakaway and James goes backhand forehand goal. That goal knocks us and we've got a tie game in Flamborough. Later in the second now the Griffins on the power play looking to restore their lead. Matt Becca knocks it in out front but it's waved off for a kicking motion and we stay deadlocked at 2-2. Later in the second now the Tigers on the power play and it's a good setup for Paul Geiger. Matt Camilleri stacks the pads and gets a piece of it and the Griffins would kill for penalty. Some good work from the Griffins netminder and they need him again before the period was over. Joel Knight is denied by Camilleri and we would stay tied after 40. Into the third we go, more Tigers pressure. Josh Rinaldi is back door, but he's stopped by Camilleri. The Tigers would regroup and set it up for Jordan Janak. Camilleri gets a shoulder on it, and we stay knotted once again. Later in the period, now still tied at 2-2. It's a stretch pass for Remy Giftopoulos. Remy looks five hole. Daniel Svedin turns away. Still in the third, now the Tigers pressing for the game breaker. Bo Webster circles the net and spots up Paul Geiger back door. Matt Camilleri kicks a pad out. And this one would stay tied, so we'd need overtime. Into overtime now, the Griffins blow the zone, and it's a 2-on-1 for Wentworth. Tyler Van Cleef walks into the slot, and he buries the game winner! It's huge from Tyler Van Cleef, as the Wentworth Griffins come in on top in game one. This one ending with a final score of 3-2 on Thursday night. We uh, had a great start, a uh, great first period by the guys, especially back end, uh, Cami and Net. Uh, fast forward to the second and third, it was a tight game, kind of... Uh, Got a little sloppy on our end, but we found a way to get it done in overtime, and uh, luckily uh, we, we got it done at home. So off uh, to Saturday, Stony Creek, and finish the job. Lucky that Harv got it out there with a chip. Uh, saw that I had an opportunity, grabbed it, two on one, and the D just gave me the room. Uh, just tried to pull it in and, and just go far side, so luckily it went in. Um, overtime goal, so can't ask for anything better than that. Our boys have come through for me all year. It was just a pleasure to be able to help them out a couple times in the second and third there, and uh, they finished her off in OT. That's how we've been all year. We just bail each other out time and time again, and it, uh, it's been an awesome year to play with these guys. I'm really lucky to be a part of this team.